Mom, blessings to you today on this Mother's Day and all the days to come. All right, you guys ready? Let's go. Hello, dear friends. Welcome back to the Majestic Family Channel. My name is Jory and my lovely wife, Biname, or B, is actually exercising right now, so I'm taking this opportunity to do a video about her for Mother's Day. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, comment down below so we can stay in touch. Don't forget to like, share, and turn on your notification bell so you know when a new video comes out. Seven reasons why my wife is the most amazing mother. Number one reason why my wife is the most amazing mother is that she is patient. Being a mom takes loads of patience and my wife is awesome at it. Bename knows how to be patient when patience is a virtue. Let me tell you, if any of you have children, you know what I mean. And my wife does a great job of in the midst of difficulty or struggle with the kids, just <sighs> calm down, it'll be okay. She homeschools the children, she runs you know, the YouTube channel with me, she maintains the household. There are other side things that we do, I mean, I call them, there are other businesses that we work on as well, other ventures, uh, and so Bename is extremely busy. When I'm ready to explode and get upset about something they're doing, Biname is calm and collected. And that's what it takes a lot of times. So my hat's off to her at being very patient with raising the children. As you know, we have an 11 year old, a nine year old, and a two year old. And we have a lot of irons in the fire at the same time. We're doing a lot of different things. And so being patient is essential uh, especially when your husband isn't always the most patient. <laughs> I do pretty good, but there are times when it's hectic and Biname as, as a mother is very patient. Next reason why my wife is the most amazing mother is she's fun and spontaneous. Biname finds ways to have fun with the children and to be spontaneous. She's awesome at it. Let me show you what I mean. Come on. Okay guys, so this is what I wanted to show you. Look at this. This is Javen's room door. We're painting the trim and the doors in the house. Biname had a little extra paint the other night and in the bottom of the pan she was gonna use up and she came up with this fun idea just off the top of her head to write a little note on each of the kids' doors. Here's Bella's door. And then here's their bathroom across the hallway. <laughs> That's my wife. That's when she's fun and spontaneous. And I love that about her, that she finds these wonderful moments um, just to be so fun and spontaneous. Okay, so that's just an example of how Biname is spontaneous and fun. And I love that about her. By the example I gave of Biname painting the children's doors, we have a task we're doing throughout the house. We're trying to get all the doors painted and the trim. Uh, Biname has been working very hard on that and yet you know she had a little extra paint and she thought this is fun why don't I write a little message to the kids on their doors so Biname knows how to be spontaneous and have fun which makes her an amazing mother you have to be ready in any moment to to maybe switch things up a little or be ready for whatever comes at you to be spontaneous and then just choose to have fun sometimes she'll just run outside and play with the kids spur of the moment and play soccer with Javen or do something with Bella, play basketball or with Ellie or do chalk on the sidewalk. She's fun. She's a fun mom. All right. The next reason why my wife is the most amazing mother is that she is calm. In the midst of chaos, Biname can keep her cool, keep her wits about her and do what needs to be done. In instances where most parents would freak out, like in an emergency with their child, Biname, my wife, stays calm, cool, and collected. Now there's an example of this recently in our neighborhood where a, a young child uh, had an accident and ran into a mailbox. 
Now this isn't your normal mailbox, it's a mailbox made of brick. And it's very, you know, this big structure. And they were riding on this motorized, uh, this powered motorcycle, a small one, but going pretty fast, and hit head first into this mailbox. And it was really bad. And the mother was there, and, and as you know, a mom, in those instances, it's hard to keep cool. And uh, Biname came um, and took charge of the situation and was calm and did what needed to be done for the mother and the child uh, and for all the others that were there. There were other children there. The mother had several kids. This is just an example. I know it's not Biname's child, but Biname is the same way. Eliana had an instance where she fell and hit her teeth into her lip. And uh, I had a hard time keeping my cool, but Biname was calm and cared for Ellie and did what needed to be done. She's done this for all the children. Being able to stay calm like that is amazing in the midst of chaos, and Biname does so well at that. All right, the next reason why my wife is the most amazing mother is that she is intelligent. Now, I'm not talking about just brains, because she has that for sure, but she has this way of getting straight to the issue in any situation, or straight to the point, or, you know, I sometimes get muddied or clouded in the details of what's happening. Biname knows, it, when it comes to the children, Biname knows exactly what the issue is and she pinpoints it and she deals with it. She's amazing at this. She can't be fooled. If the kids are trying to pull one over on her or hide something, she can find it. All right, the next reason why my wife is the most amazing mother, she is consistent. There, Biname is fantastic at no matter what's going on, she makes sure the kids have certain things and they do certain things. There's consistency from every aspect, meals and schoolwork and, um, you know, love and affection and, you know, you know, making sure they're doing what they need to in the morning with their chores and, you know, um, just being there for them in so many ways. She doesn't drop the ball. She, even though she may have a million things to do, she makes sure that she's consistent with the kids, which is fantastic. When it comes to structured discipline, like if you did this, this is what happens. You're gonna you know, lose a privilege or whatever it might be. She stays consistent so the kids know what to expect. And that's amazing. The next one on my list is my wife is fair as a mother. She, despite what she may be thinking or feeling, she's fair with the children. Uh, if they're having a bad day or acting out, um, she, she handles that, but if she's promised something or, you know, if, if one kid, one child does something different than another, she makes sure she's fair. Uh, you know, the chores are set out fairly. They, things they are expected to do around the house, their tasks or whatever are fair. And the way she handles conflict with the children and each thing on a daily basis, she's fair. She doesn't overcompensate toward one child or the other. And I really admire that about her, that she's fair in the way she handles the children. And the last thing on my list, my wife is an amazing mother because she is gentle. Uh, even in situations where dad might tend to be more harsh, Biname stays gentle. You know, you can, you can uh, I've learned from her that you can uh, deal with a problem or or uh, work through things, or even just give an order, like, hey, we're gonna go here, do this, but do it in a more gentle way. She doesn't raise her voice, she's able to do things in a gentle way. And so I really appreciate that about her. I think my wife is the most amazing mom because she handles our kids so well in so many different ways, while also handling a million other things, including spending time with me. And so she's an amazing wife and she's an amazing mother and she's an amazing everything. But to be able to mother well in the midst of all these responsibilities is amazing. And that's why I think my wife is the most amazing mother. All right, so this has been my little tribute to my wife for Mother's Day. Giving a shout out to your mom or your wife who is the mother of your children. Uh, my mom raised four boys. Thank you, mom, for, for raising us and for sticking with it. And, and, you know, she did homeschooling and a lot of other things too. Just make sure that you're, you're honoring them for all that they are and all that they do in your life. Uh, I'm going to leave you with that. Keep an eye out for other videos coming up. We're thinking about doing another Mother's Day themed video uh, with the children on gift ideas for mom. 
So keep an eye out for that. Hope you guys have a great weekend. And as always, dear friends, keep looking up.